dare to be different, dare to make an impact in your world, Rhapsody of Realities Tavo is a great place to start. Get answers to life's questions from God's Word, as you study the messages in this devotional daily. You can be sure to live a successful and victorious life. The Bible says let no one despise your youth, but be an example to the believers in word, in conduct, in love, in spirit, in faith, in purity. Welcome to Rhapsody of Realities TV episode, brought to you by Raptured Pedcast Page. Blessed day, this is Open Mic with Jasmine, and welcome to another episode of Rhapsody of Realities TV, a daily devotional reading for every teens. Let the Word of God dwell in you. Today's reading is It's Your Authority to Operate in the Authority and Character of Jesus. To the Bible, 1 John chapter 4 verse 17, Love has been perfected among us in this, that we may have boldness in the day of judgment, because as He is, so are we in this world. Let us talk. The Lord Jesus has all authority in heaven and earth. He said in Matthew chapter 28 verses 18 to 19, all authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. By that statement, He gave His authority to us, the Church, everything that exists in this world and beyond is subject to His name. The name of Jesus means much more than an identity. It refers to His authority and His character. Being born again, you were born into Christ. You inherited His name. Therefore, you have His authority and His character. You function in His place. Understand this. When you talk, move, or act, it's literally Jesus talking, moving, and acting. Of heaven, hell, nature, living and non living things respond to you as they would to Jesus. What a blessed reality! You have heaven's respect. You can go anywhere and be heard. You can pray to God Almighty and He'd answer, all because of Jesus in His name. You have authority over devils. You can speak with new tongues, take up serpents. If you drink any deadly thing, you'll not be hurt. And you can lay hands on the sick, and they'll recover. Blessed be God. No demon, sickness, or trouble can stand against that name. In His name, you're more than a conqueror. You're a champion forever, eternally fruitful and productive. Use that name today. Hallelujah. Read the book of Matthew chapter 28 verses 18 to 19 and Philippians chapter 2 verses 9 to 11. Let us pray. Pray these words with me. Dear Father, I thank you for the power you've granted me in the name of Jesus. In his name, I live triumphantly over and above circumstances and the perils of this world. I live in perpetual peace prosperity, health, success, and greatness. Hallelujah. Let's do this. Get the message authority in the name of Jesus from the Pastor Chris Digital Library app to know what the name of Jesus represents to the church and you. Operate in the character and authority of Jesus. Once you have it, every goodness will follow. If there is something that you want to change, just say it boldly and that certain situation will quickly be changed for you have the authority to do it so as Jesus can. Blessed be God. Make Jesus your new lifestyle. 
If you are not yet transformed, I invite you to make Jesus Christ the Lord of your life today by saying these words of prayer. O Lord God, I come to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Your word says, that whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. I believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. I believe Jesus died for me and that he was buried and raised from the dead. Right now, I confess with my mouth that Jesus Christ is Lord of my life. I receive by faith eternal life into my spirit. Thank you Lord for saving my soul. I now have Christ dwelling in me. I am saved, I am born again, I am a new creation. Congratulations! You are now a child of God. Let us know you are blessed by tapping the comment below. For continuous changes, messages today. Kindly heart and comment. Let us know on how the episode helped you today. Now that you're blessed, don't let the message stop on you, please share. And help us reach the ends of the world. God bless you. It is important for you to be led in the right direction, message us today.